what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so we're gonna be talking about jeepers creepers 5 yes <laughs> jeepers creepers 5 as you see here on your screen this is a screenshot from oral oral distribution.com oral studios they're one of the production companies behind jeepers creepers reborn and they have a listing up on their site for a upcoming film titled jeepers creepers 5 so i've been getting this sent to me oh did you see this yes i've seen it seen it countless times uh i don't think that this is anything we should be overly excited about only because of the fact we haven't seen jeepers creepers 4 yet even if this is them showing a glimpse of confidence in what they have you know this could again just it's it seems like this is more of a placeholder and just if they have a jeepers creepers 4 be the success that they think it will be then this is one of the things that you could expect to have happen after because that's just how it works just like how with screen 5 that outperformed uh screen 4 in very quick time and within a month of the movie being out the sixth installment has already been announced confirmed it's going to be shot this summer you know they were already prepping for it so maybe this is something similar here with jeepers creepers 5 maybe there's something already in place for a fifth movie and if the fourth one is successful they're going to rush and jump right into jeepers creepers 5 but who knows at this point i don't think that this means that jeepers creepers 5 is confirmed by any means i think this is just them having a placeholder on the site for if the film that we haven't even seen yet <laughs> is a success and again i think jeepers creepers 4 is going to be more of a success internationally than in the states i think in the states we're going to get that typical you know couple days release in theaters fathom event type of junk and then straight to vod sometime after meanwhile internationally the movie might make 10 million dollars while in the states it makes 1 million dollars this is i don't see this being a box office hit i don't see i haven't seen any screen media film i might be mistaken correct me if i'm wrong i haven't seen any screen media film that's been a box office hit in the sense of you've had over 30 to 40 even 50 60 70 80 90 100 million dollars made from a screen media distributed film in the states or anywhere i haven't seen that happen jeepers creepers 3 didn't even make that much money so i don't know what their plan is this movie probably wasn't made for much again we still expecting this to be low budget just like most of them are you consider them all to be low budget outside of jeepers creepers 2 of course but i don't think that this movie is going to break box office numbers or anything it's not going to hold any records like how jeepers creepers 1 and 2 did it's not going to do that by any means so this could be like how the saw movies are made for relatively inexpensive amounts of money from our perspective in the terms of movie making so that's why you kept getting sequel after sequel after sequel because of all the money they kept making back if they're able to multiply that with jeepers creepers 4 by five four six times even and it's made for like let's say four or five million dollars but they make uh 15 million <laughs> not even let's say like they make 8 million they're gonna rush out and go make another 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 jeepers creepers movie if anything i honestly also think this was be this is just another hint of proof going on about the amount of time that screen media has and those production companies as a whole have to make these jeepers creepers movies as it relates to this supposed contract that's in place where victor salva is leasing renting the rights to these production companies so they can make whatever they want from his ip uh and of course paying him in the process to rent these rights and still push out as much content as they can while they still have the ability to do so before the contract is up so you know hot shotting jeepers creepers movies out there like this these movies probably aren't going to be that great they probably aren't going to be anything you're going to want to run around talking about to your friends or anything like that they'll probably be your i i don't even know what they what they're thinking here jeepers creepers 5 isn't isn't something that's confirmed i i literally think it's just a placeholder on the website i really do think this also speaks to them being prepared to just rush out and make as much as they can while they can until that contract that they have in place with victor runs out once it runs out to my best knowledge of course that means the rights com will reverse completely right back to victor and we're still going to be sitting in the same position where we're sitting around waiting and hoping that something of quality happens with the franchise where you have jonathan brick you have gina phillips you have ray wise you have 
something that is deserved of a follow-up to what was done with the 2001 movie and the 2003 film not to say that Jeepers Creepers 4 is going to be terrible but again I know that a lot of you are skeptical and doubtful also kind of disappointed that this is still just another movie that you can kind of see is not going to be lining up in the quality aspect of what the first two brought us and that's just how it seems is going to be until victor salva is no longer with us and it's just unfortunate because again i can say that i believe he is responsible for one of the greatest missed opportunities in horror because of his disgusting things that he has done in the past deciding to mix all of that in with his profession and just exploring himself in the worst way you can possibly explore that type of life that's not how there's nothing wrong with the type of life he wants to live if he is someone who is gay that is fine but you know we're still gonna say what you did is disgusting because it involved a child it's disgusting uh but again we're in this position only because of what he did and we will continue to remain in this position as long as this person exists and he has all the rights in the world to hold on to what he he knows brought him to the dance that's his that's his claim to fame jeepers creepers is victor salva no one talks about any other victor salva movie maybe powder if you're a big powder fan i know i enjoyed that movie growing up i think jeff goldblum was in it uh but that's really the only other jeepers creepers or other victor salva film i know that i see people talk about often most of the time they're talking about jeepers creepers nobody else is running around talking about any other victor salva film victor salva is not a household name i just think that april is going to be the release date at this point for everyone if they change it they change it but i know australia has it for april got that confirmed to me by someone in australia germany seems to have it like that too if you go on to the eco player website i'll try to leave that in the description as well i just think that that uh that listing on oral distribution.com is just a placeholder for something that they hope will happen and they look like they'll be bringing back Timo if they want to, I guess. But let me know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below. I don't think that this is a confirmation about Jeepers Creepers 5. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications. You never miss a video. In the description, I have links to my social media accounts, my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course, to let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.